My first memory of basketball, I remember my mom telling me the day I was born when my grandma found out how big I was. She said she's going to play for UConn one day. And then growing up, everyone always told me to play basketball and I was just refusing. <laughs> and then finally in fifth grade, I decided to try it out. And from then I, I quit every other sport I played. And just from that moment, I knew like basketball was what I loved. From the first day I started playing. Growing up, my dad, he played basketball and baseball when he was younger, but they always emphasized school first. Then I played every sport. They signed me up for soccer, swimming, gymnastics. I tried everything until I found basketball, and then I only played basketball after that. My uncles, they all played basketball when they were younger, so I had a lot of support once I start pl started playing. I just like how the game, you never have a, like, a dull moment. You're always moving, you're always up and down the court. There's no, you always gotta be on your toes, ready to go, like ready to make a decision. Or the defense, offense, you always have to be thinking and moving around. Well, after my, like, my second season playing basketball, I got recruited to play on a AAU team for travel. And that's really like, I've met a lot of like great people, great coaches. And that's when I really was like, I want to do this. I want to play in college. I want to play in high school. And I would work out every day <laughs> after school. So initially, I wanted to go away. I wanted to go far from home. I wanted to go to Connecticut, Colorado, anywhere off of Staten Island. And then Coach Shanahan, the former coach, reached out to me as I was debating on where to go. And as soon as I came here, I knew I loved it. They all welcomed me, and it just felt like a family. And Coach Shanahan, he brought me on this court, and we were just standing here, like, looking around. And he was like, can't you see yourself playing here? And I was like, yeah, I can. And from then, I just felt like home. <laughs> from day one, I knew I wanted to do something in the medical field. And with nursing, you get, like, such a personal like experience with the patients. You really get to help them. You're the one there to comfort them, to make sure they're okay, to talk to their families. I like that, like being able to help people. That's what drew me to nursing. Basketball definitely helps me with the academics because everyone is on top of you, making sure, you know, did you study for your tests? Do you need help? Everyone's always willing to help you if you need it. So. There's like a good support system, you know, if you ever fall behind, there's going to be people there to help you get back on track. Part of the reason why I chose to come to CSI was because of the nursing program and I wanted to be able to, you know, pursue my career and play basketball. But now that I get the chance to do both and now play at a higher level is really like just amazing. Academically, there's so many opportunities for programs and degrees here and they all are you know, putting us into the direction of a professional career. I feel like my team were like laying the foundation for the future, for the future you know, recruits and teams to come in, and that what we establish here, especially moving up to D2, is gonna be, you know, determines how far the school can go in the future. I look forward to just being the best basketball player I can be and just every year improving anything that I can to just really succeed and help the team succeed. I would say definitely come and just go on a tour of the campus and meet the people here because that's what really made me want to come here. I feel like it's just a great experience here so far. Everyone from the people, like, classes, basketball, everywhere. It's just, it's been a great experience so far. My name is Kayla Schmitter. I am a scholar. I am an athlete. I am the College of Staten Island. And we are NCAA Division II.